Hey guys, Rob here from MikeCon. Uh, it's been a while or a long time since we brought you one of our You Asked For videos, in which we cover questions that our customer service team get asked on a regular basis, or in this case, are about to get asked. Today, we're gonna answer, what's the difference between the Tim and the Timmy from 3K? Up first is the Tim. It was introduced back in August of 2022, and it replaced the popular A3 and A4 thermal copiers. The main objective of the Tim was to solve the issues that arose when stencil paper companies started to change the dyes they were using. The Tim runs at higher and faster exposure speeds to reduce the amount of time your stencil is exposed to the heat, all while providing you with shorter cooling times and 25% less energy consumption. Fast forward almost nearly one year and the Timmy joins the party. The Timmy is a more cost-effective copier that saves you some money by removing features that are not 100% necessary to producing a stencil. Yep, you're gonna be a bit more manual here. When it comes to overall performance, both of these copiers are up to the task of producing crisp clean stencils. Just depends on how hands-on you like to be in your stencil making process. The Tim has an auto sensor that kicks things off the second it registers that a carrier sheet's been entered and auto shuts off once your stencil's complete. The Timmy, on the other hand, requires you to push and hold a feed button while running your stencil through, and it leaves it up to you when to start and stop the bulb from rolling. As for the cool down process, the Tim has a sensor controlled cooling. This means that it only cools when the device is warm and it cools even faster when the machine reaches maximum temperature. This overheat mode will force you to take a short break when the copier starts to overheat. How short you may ask? Well, the A3 and A4 copiers used to require 10 to 15 minutes to cool down, while the Tim will have you back making copies in as little as six or seven minutes. As for the Timmy, it's an overachiever. It keeps on going, and unlike the Tim, you won't get a warning or a forced shutdown. You simply have to recognize that it's getting warm and give it a bit of a breather in between stencils. Which of these models is best for your shop? Well, the Timmy copier is designed for life in small to medium tattoo shops or studios, where it won't be running all day long. So if your copier liner looks like a Tim Hortons drive through on a Monday morning, you might want to take a look at the Tim. Tim bit bonus fact. The Timmy weighs in at 8.3 pounds, making it just under 50% lighter than the Tim. At the same time, it's 27% smaller footprint, means it takes up less space in your stencil station or your convention booth. Yes, you can travel with a thermal copier. The Tim is at home in any size shop or studio, but excels in larger shops that need a copier to run constantly all day long. Its internal sensors mean you don't have to worry about wasting stencils in an overheated machine, and when it does overheat, you'll get back up and running sooner. Both these models require some maintenance on your end in order to keep your stencils looking crisp and clear. Like with all copiers, over time, the fans and the motion of these copiers will push any dirt and debris onto the bulb, which will then begin to darken and soften your stencil's edges. So be sure to keep it clean. Stay tuned for our cleaning video headed your way very soon. This is a good time to remind you that Icon is an authorized 3K and Pananka service provider. And if your copier needs a little tune-up or a bit of a cleaning, we can take care of that for you. To learn more about the maintenance and upkeep of your A3, A4, or Tim and Timmy, get in touch with our customer service team via chat, email, or on the old fashioned phone lines. That's it, that's all we got for you right now. Let us know if you have any additional questions about the Tim or Timmy thermal copiers, and we'll get those answers to you. You can also tell us if there's any other products you'd like to see us feature in a video like this. Thanks for watching. It's your studios where the copper has to, won't waste time with stencils being overheat. Fuck. Its internal sensors mean you don't have to waste. Its internal sensors mean you don't have to waste. Fucking Christ. Its internal sensors mean you don't have to worry about wasting stencils in an overheated machine. And when it does overheat, you'll get back up and running sooner. All right.